on the intro which is distorted. Don't forget to go to E flat for this song, like the, all the early Slayer stuff. Okay, I'll play that slowly now. Here we go. Now basically you play that twice, so it's that pattern twice, so you'll end up with changing this 2 to a 3rd fret there, like that. Okay, and it's the same thing, you play this pattern twice, so. And then all we do is we go across to the A string for the 3rd fret, and we're skipping the D when we play the pattern this time, just once through, so. And same again, but second fret on the A. Okay, so one more time, but slowly. So this is the whole riff now. series of distorted riffs on the intro now so I'll go for this is the first thing you actually hear on the song so here we go <laughs> Basically, you could put an E minor in and just slightly kill that G string. I just do it with one finger, so I'm still flattening the A and D on the second fret, but I'm still killing the G. And all you do is you're hitting the first three and the last three. Then the next part, I'm just flattening the second fret over to the first on the A for a bend and then two F power chords and that's it. Okay on the next part of that riff he just substitutes the E minor for this. Do that slowly. if you play as before she'll end up with okay now over the clean riff that we played at the start you've got a series of chords so they're pretty slow so I'll play those now and then you can just copy those so section which is this and that's over the back of the clean bit okay there's the first heavy riff Thank you. 
basically just changes the ending so I'll play it as it is and I'll slow it down do that again and slower okay here's the verse Okay, so what you basically got on this is this again it's the same thing a few times, so I'll play it slow, so this would be the first time round. you replace um, this ending with so now I'll play them with both endings slow on that chord, it's pretty easy, that's just all power chords.